Bird is shooting only 40% of the series, misses his first shot. Haywood, who has been smoking, bangs his in. Blocked by Haywood, kept in play by Greavy. Haywood, Johnson in the middle, nice dish off. Oh, wow. Outstanding dish off. Now Carl works inside. Haywood was there. And here is Spencer Haywood leading the charge. Gets it to the right man in the middle, who gets it right back. Archibald, no. The Celtics have hit only two hoops so far in this game. Pretty much slow motion. All right, Haywood gets the step and goes right through Bird. Spencer Haywood flying to the basket. He has six of the Washington 13. They lead 13 to nine. Slipped out of the hand. Haywood again muscles inside. It counts and he is fouled. So Spencer Haywood becomes the first player to hit double figures tonight. Watch Spencer give an excellent head fake. There it was right there. Head, shoulder fake. Gathered himself together so that he could go up strong to the basket with that baby hook shot. And there it is, Maxwell helping out. He was the man left back there, gets the foul. Well, that was a beautiful back door. It is. Larry uh, Bird trying to catch up with the play. The horn gives it to Ruland. Shows me uh, Haywood, who runs his baseline, draws the uh, defense off of Ruland and was able to squeeze it through. Haywood. Oh. He knew that was going in as soon as he let it go. He faked inside and then quickly popped outside and nailed about an 18-footer. Look at Spencer Haywood getting loose underneath, and it's tied again. That's the second personal foul on Robert Parrish. The first on the Celtics in the third quarter, and the basket is no good. We're going to get an offensive foul on Spencer Haywood, his fourth personal foul. Not much question about who creates the contact here. He backs it in with uh, one dribble and then just clears Bird out of there. Haywood swishes it through. He has 17. Well, it's going to have to become run and, run and shoot pretty much and uh, I would think it'll give the opportunity, uh, the Celtics the opportunity to break it open. That says an awful lot for what the Celtics are doing offensively.